Today we're going to talk about compass calibration. When you receive your Kestrel 4500 and any time you replace the batteries, you're going to need to calibrate the compass on it in order to get an accurate compass direction. When you do this and you're replacing your batteries, don't forget to make sure that the plastic shim that came with your Kestrel is put back in in between the batteries. This helps make sure that the batteries are in the correct position, the same that they were in our factory when we calibrated the compass um, and installed it. When you're done with this, uh, put it in and turn your Kestrel on. Your Kestrel will uh, ask you to put in the date and time, and once you've done that, you'll get to the system menu. From the menu, you want to scroll down to the system option, and then after selecting that with the enter button, you want to hit compass calibration. When you get to this, it'll show you the directions which say hold the Kestrel upright, rotate three times slowly, around 10 seconds per turn. What you want to do is, um, if you have a table, put it on a table or a flat surface and have it stand up vertically. Um, and make sure it doesn't wobble in any direction. Once you have it set up and you're ready to go, you can press the center button to start and rotate it slowly. You can count to 10 for each rotation or however you'd like to do it, but it just needs to go around three times slowly. Um, if you look at the Kestrel screen while you're doing this, it will say, it will actually be counting the rotations for you, and it'll tell you how many rotations you've done. So when you finish three, it'll say, it'll quickly say calculating, and then it'll say calibration complete. When you've done this, you can hit the red, uh, X, the red menu power button, and then get back to your main screen, and your compass is calibrated.